Hey guys, Johnny back at again with another video and we are going to be talking about the return of Korea Tyler. And this is a big one for me. That's what she said. <laughs> Cuz I've been influenced by this guy a lot. I used to have him incorporated in my old older videos, his type of style, his music that he used for some of his old videos I put into it. And I just think it's insane that he is actually getting back on YouTube and he's doing what he had promised. He, he's not, he's finally doing what he's promising. Now before he would say that he's uploading daily and he didn't even upload daily as you can clearly see. But it's insane because he has been uploading every single Sunday weekly. Um, he's uplo uploading weekly as he did explain in his episode 1 video. Every week that he doesn't drop a video, he's getting a tattoo of every letter of my name on his leg. So. Wait, let's shake on it, let's shake on it. We and I just want to talk about his return with everybody. I think that we shouldn't take this we shouldn't take this lightly because I know that um, what he's done, he's scammed a lot of people and all that. But the thing is that I don't have any beef against, I don't, also, I don't have any beef against this guy. And I don't think anything bad should be shunned upon him coming back on YouTube. He just explain. he just does his own style. He just does his own thing. He doesn't really have th have anything else to do the the scamming portion of what he has done was bad but he got a lot of money off that one video that he did post um the college dropout video if you are on youtube you have to know about that video if you spend much of your time on youtube like i do chances are you probably come across this video of this 19 year old if you um or you're just low-key clueless about what's going on and yeah he, like he also shows and his uh career toddler is a scammer video and uh that w how he was able to get that money and what he's done and the process of what he had gone through and i think the process of what we're gonna see um and i just think it's insane that he just started off by showing this. It allowed me to travel all around the world the whole past year. A lot more people knew who I was, and because of that, a lot more brands and companies would just email me and and they'd ask me to make them videos the way I make my own YouTube videos. So I ran with this opportunity the whole year. I moved back to LA. Tyler. So the past three months, I've been living in this house with some of my best friends who I met in Miami. The fact that he uh, was able to get all that money and all that uh, viewing and, and more people knowing his name through the video that he posted, uh, the college dropout video, shows that he's been doing a lot this year. He's been secretly doing a lot. And even though he posts, oh, should I post this video today and all that, um, he did post that. I've done that before. Um, I do understand what he, where he's coming from with that. Like, I posted a oh, video coming out soon, and it, I just never get to post in the video. I still have videos that I'm uploading now that are from a long time ago. Um, so I see where he's coming from with all that. I just think we probably shouldn't take this lightly. We should, we probably shouldn't think, oh, he's just, he's a whole entire new person, da da da. But. I just want to I just want to appreciate the fact that he is coming back on YouTube. I don't have any hard hard things against the guy. I don't even know the guy personally. He he has commented on some of my on one of my Instagram posts and he has liked like two of my Instagram posts before. So thank you for that uh Tyler. Um and yeah, I just 
wanted to make a video about Tyler and his return. Um, I think it's good that he's actually coming back, that he's actually making videos, that he did all this planning behind it, that he is, is incorporating more people and his friends, that he isn't caring about what people are, are saying about him or have said about him. Takes pictures of cities all around the world, private jets, G-wagons, hot tubs, Blue ass water, blue ass water. I'm really interested in what we're gonna see from him. I know that he posted about him uh, doing some stuff for uh, people in Mexico, like giving supplies to children schools. I think that's really nice. Um, we were just talking about how we wanted to leave LA and do something different for once. We wanted to go on a trip. But instead of doing cool stuff and trying to have fun like we normally do, we wanted to give back, and we wanted to make a difference in the world. That next day, we literally just bought a ticket and left to Mexico. But then again, we should just be careful. We Be careful, and let's just see what's happening with his return. Uh, if you guys have any comments or anything down below, please let me know. I am Johnny23, and thank you. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye-bye. I've been fucking hoes and popping pillies, man. I feel just like a rock star. All my brothers got that gas and they always be smoking like a rock star. Fucking with me, call up on no Uzi and show up, man, them the shot tops.